Hey everyone and welcome to the video. So today what we're taking a look at is some ear cups, essentially some silicon ear cups. These are from AliExpress and to be perfectly honest, these are a product that I really didn't want to buy, but I figured seeing as everybody loves the AliExpress video so much, I'll have a go and see what they're actually like. Now, to be perfectly honest, the only reason I actually ordered these was simply to actually change the, the color and the look of the AirPods as opposed to um, being for protection. With regards to the actual AirPods themselves, AirPods Max, um, I don't really have any issues with durability of these. Um, generally, I've got them inside the main case and then I've got a separate carrying case for them as well. So in terms of protection, um, it's not too much of an issue. But I know a few people did raise the fact that what happens when you're taking them out of the case and they're constantly banging uh, banging into each other um, and that's basically what the sort of concern was about so with these I'm presuming these just slip straight on I'm not sure entirely whether you meant to take the okay well that's not a great fit so unless these are unless you're supposed to take the ear cups off and then apply them okay they're not the easiest to put on I'll tell you that much so how does everything line up. You do need to get it quite accurate once you're actually lining stuff up. Okay, and what we'll do is we'll just chuck the cut back in. Right, so now essentially what you have is not so great cutouts. Um, I'm not 100% sure if these are even on the right ear cup. Obviously this one can only be for this side um, because of the digital crown and the button and the build quality is not the best as you can see. Yeah, so far I'm not very, not very impressed in terms of how you actually go about getting these on. Okay, so here we are back with um, the blue pair roughly fitted. Just get that into focus. And as you can see, they're not perfect, uh, far from it. Um, you've got a bit of a gap there. Uh, it also doesn't really wrap around. I'm not sure what these top cutouts are for, they don't seem to be lining up with any of the sensors. The bottom ones seem fine in terms of covering or giving you cutouts for sensors at the bottom, but essentially um, the ones at the top don't seem to be doing much similar thing on this side as well. So digital crown, okay that's not great. So if you notice the rubber just wraps around and unless you can get it in perfect position that's actually obstructing the digital crown so that's not great the button uh, that's terrible <laughs> so the button has no feel whatsoever first impressions um, I would not recommend these yes they offer a little bit of protection um, and it does give you a slightly different look as well obviously this is changing up the look quite a bit let me just try one of the other colors and we'll see if they fit any better okay so here we are back with the white um, to be perfectly honest the white is a little better um, the button the crown is still not great because basically what happens is the crown has a, a sort of raised section that actually allows it to spin a little easier and the problem with putting this sort of skin on and essentially any case is similar to like your power buttons on your phones where it ends up raising the surface around it so it means that the crown itself isn't as um, pronounced so you can't actually latch onto it as easy now on this one let me just try it with them on okay so the button does work um, it just doesn't have any tactile feedback whatsoever the white on the black I do prefer a bit more to the blue the blue didn't really have enough of a contrast um, this this one is a little better to be fair. All right, let's just take a look at the cutouts and hopefully you should be able to see that the bottom ones aren't perfectly aligned. Um, I'm not sure what these ones along the top are even for. They don't seem to be for anything. Uh, this one is not lined up correctly. I think the main issue is actually getting it to seat and go fully round the ear cups. That seems to be the biggest problem as you can see with the lightning port as well um, it's not perfectly centered around that little microphone and what it also does it covers up the little led as well um, i can see it through the white but on the other colors it's, it's not quite as pronounced 
Okay, and finally, here we are back with the black, and I realized that these ones, they do have obviously microphone sensors at the top. It's just because this skin simply doesn't wrap around far enough, you're never seeing more than half of the actual microphone hole, um, which presumably will also affect all of your noise cancellation um, because your microphones aren't essentially going to be able to do their job correctly. That's what we have at the bottom side microphones and along this side as well. I mean in terms of changing up the look and the feel, yes, um, ironically it actually feels very similar to the headband <laughs> in that sense. Um, so yeah, it does allow you to change up, change up the look, change up the feel of the the AirPods Max, but to be perfectly honest, um, anybody out there thinking about buying these, um, my advice would be don't, uh, because it's not a product that even does does what it's meant to do. Um, if it doesn't fit properly, then it's never going to wrap around, it's never going to allow your microphones and everything to work correctly. What I also noticed was, especially on the white, was on the, you might not be able to see that on the camera, so I'll try and show you on the blue. So you might just be able to see um, all of these sort of leftover sort of um, residue and silicon from obviously the, the molding process and what what tends to happen is it transfers onto the actual ear cups and it was more prominent on the white when I actually took them off um, it was actually very um, marked up um, obviously it's, it's literally just rubber so it just washes straight off or, or even wipes straight off you don't need to wash them or anything um, but yeah um, I thought obviously when, once I'd got the AirPods Max I was looking for what type of accessories AliExpress has come up with and this was pretty much the first sort of thing that popped up um, and yeah I'd say don't buy these um, then they're, they're really not gonna help you in the long term um, yeah they might stop when you're actually taking it out of the case they might stop this section just clanging there um, but personally I mean obviously I've, I've had these for I'd say nearly two to three weeks now I've been using them pretty much non-stop all my editing um, also just generally around the house whenever I've been off work and I've not got any issues with with that um, obviously if you are worried about that then at the point you do actually just take them out of the case just just be a little bit more mindful and basically they won't won't bang these I'd say for anybody looking on Ali, AliExpress and similar for something, some sort of an accessory, uh, these aren't it. Um, what I, rather than this, what I would say is wait until um, some of the, well, obviously D brands and other skin manufacturers actually come out with some skins for these. I'd say the clear wrap skins, or obviously if you wanted to change the look up, then you can obviously change, uh, use one of the different colors. But I, th I think you'd be much better off with a skin and just wrapping that round rather than using one of these silicon um, sort of covers for the main reason because it, it on the digital crown, it obstructs the actual crown um, and it's also dampening down the actual power button as well. Uh, sorry, the uh, noise cancellation button. And that's, Everything else you can kind of work around, you can jiggle it around, you can get the sensors to show for the most part, but you don't really want to be messing around with your noise cancellation button and your digital crown when it comes to the feedback. So yeah, as far as I'm concerned, this product is a fail. <laughs>